uh, most awkward game. I kind of like the navigators. But I'm not sure if I should have them. Ragnarok or Drought? Hey, Maleficent. Ragnarok or Drought, guys. You decide. Pass? Wow. This is gonna be garbage. We're gonna push him round two. Even that could be chancy. No. He's gonna Ragnarok me. Like, there's zero doubt about it, right? He does have a Grammist, I believe. Damn to spy. Won't be pleased. I have to play my own spy as well. It's quite bad. Ragnarok time. We have to go for a stupidly long round two. Where we possibly lose a card. Oh boy. So that means he's probably not gonna Ragnarok me. Because he would override that better. Is that all he has? But that also means we can't play the, the riders. I can Barbagazi the the Udaric to save him from the weather. I suppose that's an option. It's a weird option. Villain. That would be like uh No, we, we kind of save him. Actually, we might not save him whatsoever. Not sure what to make of this. Let's play Rider. Maybe he's playing Grand Cyclops? Maybe. This is an incredibly, incredibly awkward uh, matchup to play because I don't even have Vetter Clear. Even if I had Vetter Clear, I would need to be super careful about using my Vetter Clear so we don't waste it. So using Barbagazi is not gonna do much good because he's gonna throw back the Dodaric in the back. I don't know. Play Rider again? I kind of value the, the movers a little bit. If he could get Iris, that could be actually very strong. However, Osrel or Roach would be pretty bad. Okay. There is no With this, we eliminate the chance of Roach. Oh, I did, did just mess up. 
That means I won't be able to play another hound. With the navigators. I can get another rider out. What am I saving Karen tier for? Well, I didn't save it for a lot. He takes his time. Wow. Come on. This is the kind of match where you can just fire up a, a TV series or whatever movie and just watch like 20 minutes of it and like and uh, that, that, that's it. In one game. So, let's get out another ride. Here. So, the X Men is. Actually, we could have uh, scorched the X Men along with uh, the spy. I suppose this is the curse of acting too fast. Told you it'd be worth it. Cards are blowing fair winds the day. Okay. More veilers. I can just move the guy away. But we can also scorch him. Azrael is like... Eh, Ozzarell is really meh. Moving the guy away is pretty good. In the front, actually. That's acceptable. He's gonna die there. You stand before the Never mind that. We have a plan B as well. So, Gals. Naivety is a fool's blessing. Has the worst options. But we can actually keep pushing this. So that villain is gonna be. Villain is actually gonna trigger. So I'm just gonna push this till villain triggers. I can move away his X-Men. That's really pretty good for a finisher. Also, Villain is not gonna be that good against the uh, X-Men that are not getting value. Yeah, but can he kill it? I don't know how. So I can get out some Hounds. Probably shouldn't. I, I should get out some Drakkars. You shall die, worm. <laughs> and to get out more Drakkars. So this is gonna die, and then we can scorch the other one if you want to. I don't think he has a way to kill the dragon. I suppose we are still getting wrecked by Vetter, but so is he. Told you be worth it. We can't kill the dragon, right? No, we can't. Time to get strong. I'm just gonna burn it. Scorch is gonna be a little bit awkward later.
So apparently we are doing the X-Men now. Scorch and pass. Yeah, that's the plan. He's gonna getting at the guy again. <laughs> He's gonna play Harald. Uh, which is gonna be a lot of points. He might not have to though. I think this is gonna push it over the top quite a bit. It's gonna be 26 by itself. Plus this is a... Uh, 5... Plus 4... Yeah, oh, that was quite a bit. Not biting frost. Okay, actually we played Gauss. So that was not an option. Okay. If I play this, he might just kill it with the ship. So we can kill it with the warship. Uh, that's an option. Also, I can do an Azrael. I would need to do Iris. So how do I do this? If he has a coral, thing is, if he has a warship, then he most likely have a warship. Then he's just gonna hit Iris, and we did nothing. If he has a coral, uh, this could be bad. But we gotta play Caretaker last. And by doing that, we're gonna get like 10 ish value from the warship and 15 from Iris. Not, not exactly 15, like 12, because we need to kill it. Yeah. Not a lot of uh, Iris value. Let's play Iris now. Uh, I don't really want to do that because if he has a. Well, it's actually acceptable. Partly because uh, if he kills it, well, we take uh, two less Ragnarok damage. I'm so very, very. But if he kills it with uh, a just a Demon Warship, then we get no value whatsoever. Enough. Uh oh. Oh, I actually messed up. I could have played... I, I, I missed out on one value. You get a drug card, but that doesn't help. So I can play this. We get... Play this for a 10. Then we get 10 more. It doesn't matter, we lose anyway. But I did miss out on one value. If I play this... If I play a uh, caretaker in the middle, then we play the guy. Then we move it in, that's 11. Plus 4. Actually, I might be miscalculating. Maybe I'm not calculating caretaker. Nope, we got it. It's a win anyway, but we did miss uh, at one point. Miss out on one point. GG. He's only level 44. What is this crap? GG. OGG oh, Smith. So not that. It would be nice to get some navigators now. No navigators. Pretty good hands, but no navigators. 26 points. What is 20? Okay, I mean 26 cards. What kind of Nova deck he might be running? It's 
So the question is, what is Carvait Nova, guys? Can Navigator pull itself? It can't. Damn Skellige haters, Skellige is honest, not like a uh, cheating, thieving Nilfgaard. I only have the problem uh, with them because they are rather defensive. Except X-Men, I suppose, somewhat. But most of the archetypes are like... Eh. just You just you do your own this? thing. No? Okay, we got a slave spammer here. Can Reaver Hunters pull themselves? No. What? <laughs> Reaver Hunters? Are you talking about the Reaver Scouts? Ooh, okay. Six points. I'll take it. Is this enough for him? One slave infantry in the graveyard. Actually, resurrecting the slave infantry is not the worst idea. Because we're gonna deny the resurrect. I need to be very careful. Yeah. I'm just gonna accept this. I can start by playing a rider. He's definitely gonna have some slaves in the back. So he's gonna play slaves. I'm not sure how you play slaves because I don't say play slaves whatsoever, but... Can you control where your no one can hide from original me. slave goes? Because that would be a big deal. If he can make sure that he can resurrect the slaves. Lato Regis combo is just casually stealing your points. But it's so damn annoying to set it up. You could have bricked his ointments, resurrected now. This world dies with it. Wait a second, he put back st stuff. But we, we kind of want to play Iris as well. That's a lot of points. Put back my bronzes? Well, thanks for that. Does he have a... A better clear? Like, these are pretty important questions. I think he might. Live and die for the Emperor. That's pretty bad. They run it, they have better clear. So do I want Drakars? Navigator, Rider... I have one Rider, which is enough. I'll just get some Drakars out. It's gonna be a long round. Huh, that was not in the spell books. So, he's resurrecting the slaves now. This is the not... Not doomed one. He's making sure that he's gonna die. I can block that. So, I'm not gonna put Frost on the first row. I'm gonna play...
right there in the front. Pulling out that guy. That was that was risky, I have to say, that frightener play. So the slave infantry is not gonna die. We still wanna, of course, set up the frost. Must be an important lesson in this. But what? He put the original one right again there. Okay, we need to establish two frosts. Okay, that card. Um, I suppose we're just gonna pull another draw card from the deck. Okay. IGN just made a joke about Gwent being stale before the Microsoft conference. Gwent is alive. They did? Such bastards. Okay. Spawn doomed. I need to move in the back. The ones that are doomed. Okay, better clear was pretty annoying. If he shuts it down, it's fine. Huh, that was not in the spell books. Come on, I just want to play Iris. New orders? Oh, no. come on! So much garbage. Spamming so much garbage. I can eat the slaves. Will he resurrect the slaves? I don't even want to play the slaves. There's not much to eat. I'm just gonna eat the slaves. Screw them. He won't. He used all three ointments. Ah, uh, good catch. As you wish. But we don't have a lot to play anyway. Oh, come on, he's still blocking the iris. We can't play villain. Also, we can't play our scorch. I can't play Scorch. I can't play my villain. I could probably put Iris in the back. Just for later. I'm so very, very afraid. But that just shows how desperate I am. Also, we can't really use actually play a random different bronze soldier from your deck. That actually works. That could be a plan B. A really crappy plan B. Yeah. Okay. Maybe he's gonna play something big. I 
I doubt it though. So he already played the spy. I can play my villain. This chaos got buffed a little bit. It's too slow, it's not gonna trigger. Maybe it's time to emote. The Enshe could surprise you at any time. Prepare to be surprised. Do the iris. Play something big. Oh no. A bit of blood letting. Okay, we're gonna scrap that. Wow. A bit messy game, but. GG.